All right, so if you wanna pitch your tent in elevated mode for greater airflow, I'm gonna show you how we do that. You're gonna start exactly the same way and do exactly the same things that we did to pitch it in no draft mode. The only difference is you're gonna run your stakes through the paracord that goes through our line lock adjusters. Jason, why don't you grab that camera if you don't mind and you can kind of walk around with me and I can show you, show you how this works. You're gonna start exactly the same way where you're gonna lay your tent out and you can see I'm gonna stake out the four corners of the tent first. This is the same for our abs, same way you're gonna pitch our abs Aroka 4P as well, um, where you're gonna pitch out the four corners first and then you're gonna pitch, pitch the, uh, excuse me, put the center pole in the middle and then stake out the rest of the remaining uh, guy out points. So, um, the other thing is our stakes um, are designed to uh, fit through our webbing loops as well as our paracord loops. So, and these are 7075 aluminum, so they're aluminum stakes, they're super light, but they're also fairly strong for what they are. So, first thing you wanna do, um, I've got one of my corners right here, and you can see that I've got this stake running through this paracord loop right here. Um, I like to pull this loop about halfway up it depends on how high you want to run this tent you can run it uh, all the way out um, but i like to start just a little ways down here and what that does is just make sure the tent you know when i want a greater an elevated tent i don't like it super high necessarily but this is still going to create a nice a nice uh, high pitch to allow for really good airflow so what you're going to do is just put that stake in the ground luckily this ground is soft right now i'm going to walk over to this side I'm gonna try and get, I'm just gonna approximate. I've already got a stake through this loop right here. I'm gonna approximate here that I've got the paracord about the same distance out here, okay? And you're just gonna kinda pull, again, pull the, pull the tent tight a little bit here so it's snug, but not, not, you don't need to make it tight. And then you're just gonna get that thing in the ground there. Remember, this is, uh, this is an art, not a science here. Okay, now I'm gonna come over to this corner. I'm gonna pull that paracord through the line lock adjuster about halfway. Run the stake through the loop. And again, I'm pulling the, the tent fabric kind of with this hand, and I'm holding this corner out. It's not tight, it's just kind of barely snug. I'm gonna push this tent stake in. Now I'm gonna to go to the last corner. I'm gonna approximate the evenness of my rectangle here it looks pretty good adjust this line lock adjuster the paracord I pull this out looks good put that in let's take it now you can see the tent you can kind of get a good picture of kind of how it's snug but not tight okay now I'm gonna open up the door here and put the center pole in Now this is where you can really adjust how high you want your tent. Right now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kinda pitch my pole relatively snug, and I'm gonna put my thumb on the adjuster here. I'm gonna go up two inches. These are one inch hole spacings on your pole. Now you can use your trekking pole for this as well. There we go. So now you can see it's, I've got my, my corners are kind of snug right now. Now I'm gonna close the door. And now I'm just gonna stake out the other points on this tent. I'm gonna use like that. Walk around to this side. And again, the nice thing about these line lock adjusters, you don't have to get your tent super tight while you're pitching it like this because I'm gonna walk around after this and I can just snug up those line lock adjusters. Okay, one more, one more steak. Okay, so now I've got all the steaks kind of uh, in the ground. Why don't you come over here, Jason? This is a good example of how, of why those lawn lock adjusters are really nice. So you can see this side has a little bit of slack in it. 
And so to snug that up, you're just gonna take this piece of paracord going through that line lock adjuster, and I'm just gonna pull it down a little bit. And it's gonna snug that up just like that. And I'm gonna do that. I don't wanna get it super tight, but I want it to be nice and snug, nice taut pitch. I'm gonna walk around to all these line locks and, and just kind of adjust them. Now, if I had one corner or one side of the tent that looked like it was had more slack than the other, I would walk down to that line lock adjuster and snug that one up first. So now I've got kind of all of these about snug exactly where I want them. And that's how you pitch it uh, in elevated airflow mode. Um, obviously I could pitch this a little taller if I wanted. So you can see there's a little space here along the bottom to allow for some airflow to come in. Um, but that's how you pitch it in elevated mode. And next up, I'm gonna show you how to pitch the tent with the insert. <laughs>